G'day guys, Menace here, and today I have a different kind of video. I will be conducting a tutorial on how to convert an image into a wonderful painting for use in Arc Survival Evolved utilizing the Arc Paint Editor program created by Dragnet. I am by no means a graphic artist or very good with graphic design, but this is just what works for me. For this tutorial, I'm going to use GIMP, which is a free image editing program, and go through the entire process step by step. This same tutorial will apply to paintings on billboards, signs and flags with respective image sizing. To begin you'll need to download GIMP from GIMP.org, then install it. Then navigate to the Arc Paint Guide found on the description and scroll down and click on this download link. You'll need a program to unzip the files. If you do not have one I suggest you use WinRAR. Extract the files into a folder somewhere we can find it. From here you'll need to load up Arc Survival Evolve and place down the object you wish to paint. For this tutorial, we will be using a billboard. Then draw a border around the edges of the billboard. I suggest not tracing the exact edge of the structure as some parts overlap of the image and it can look dodgy. Once completed, select Save Paint at the bottom of the screen. From here, exit out of Arc and open up Arc Paint Editor and select Load Arc Paint File. Following that, navigate to your Steam folder and go to the path Steam Apps, Common, Arc, Shooter Game, Saved, then My Paintings. In here will be the Mac Paint image template that we saved earlier in game. Select this then open it up, then click the save as image option and save it somewhere handy. Now we have a template for creating our picture. Now we need to open up GIMP and create a new project. Click on the file menu then select new. A new window will appear and in the image size change the figures to 512 width by 256 height then click OK. Move over to the Layers panel and delete the default background by right clicking it and then selecting Delete Layer. Then find the billboard template we created earlier and click and drag it into the project. Because of the way Arc Paintings work we will need to stretch the image to the correct resolution then back again once we are finished. To do this make sure that the layer is selected in the right hand window then click on the Layer menu at the top and select Scale Layer. Make sure that the chain link is broken and then adjust the width to 512 pixels. Then find the image that you wish to paint in game and drag it into the project. If the picture is too big use the scale layer function to make sure it fits into the template and adjust it to taste. Then delete the template layer on the right. Now we need to import the arc color palette into GIMP to make sure that the colors we are using are the same as the dyes we can create in the game. To do this select the Windows menu, open Dockable Dialogues then click Palettes. Right click in this window and go to Import Palette then select the Palette File option and click the folder on the right. In this new window locate the folder where we extracted the Arc Paint files earlier on, open up the Palettes folder then the GIMP folder and select Arc.GPL file and then import it. Now we need to apply this palette to our image. Open the image menu at the top, then go to Mode and select Indexed. In this window click on the Custom Palette option and select the one titled Arc. This will then convert the current image to the correct colour scheme. Now we need to change the image back to the correct size. To do this we need to export the image by opening the file menu and clicking Export. Make sure the file type is PNG in the drop down menu at the bottom then export the image. Close the project then drag the new PNG file we just created and adjust the size by going to the image menu, selecting scale image then changing the width to 256. Make sure that the chain is once again unlinked then click on file overwrite this image. Now close GIMP and go back to the Arc Painter program and import this image by selecting load image and locating the file we just saved. When prompted to adjust the colors select no. If all is done correctly you should see your image loaded into the program. Now click on the save as Arc Paint file button and save it back into the folder located in Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Arc, Shooter Game, Saved, My Paintings. You can change the first part of the file name but do not change anything after the first underscore or else the file will not work. 
When asked if you wish to preview the file, click yes. If all the steps were done correctly, you will see the image displayed nicely in the program. Now return to Arc Survival Evolve and using the paintbrush, open the painting menu and click the load paints from this type and select the painting we just saved. On the right you'll see two windows. The first is the dyes required and below that is the dyes missing from your inventory to complete the painting. Once that list is empty you can paint your image. After you've done that you can exit the menu and behold your masterpiece. Hopefully this tutorial helped you guys out. If you are new here check out my channel, I do news updates and heaps of gameplay on the Pooping Evolve server. My name is Menace, thanks for watching.